everybody i hope you're having a great day today welcome back to my series of book hauls and this video is all about my may book haul so last book haul i only got a few items or books to read and i'm afraid this month is no different i was really hoping to have a larger book haul this month but with so many things happening with assignments and reports and essays i just really have no time to read and Oh, I keep saying this every month, but it's the truth. So I think I'm just going to stick with books for now that are quick, fun reads or graphic novels that I really like to read. Something that's easy to get through very quickly and nothing too long or strenuous. So without further ado, let's jump into the video and I'll tell you all about the books I've gathered for this month. Okay, the first book on my list is Caravel and it's by Stephanie Garber. It's a teen or young adult book, and this is a very popular title in our library collection. It's got so many holds in it. It says here in the book, it's got a lot of um, love, heartbreak, and magic. And it centers around Scarlet Dragna. And she wishes to see Caraval, which is a once-a-year performance where the audience participates in the show. And finally, she got an invitation towards it, and... She and her sister tried to go to it, but along the way, her sister got kidnapped, and it's up to her to save her sister and to find her. And it's got a lot of mystery and a lot of things happening to it, and I think this is a really, really interesting book, and I can't wait to read this. I think the characters are very well written and well thought of, and... For a book to be very popular, the character must really, really relate to the reader. I can't wait to do a review about it. Next book on the list is just a very small one, which is You Know You're a Dog Lover When... And it's by Ben Fraser. It's just a small, tiny book. And it's just got a lot of um, little sayings and anecdotes about it. About reasons why you're a dog lover. I'm usually a cat person. I have two cats. One is Midnight and one is Shadow. But I also love dogs. I used to own dogs when I was little, but now um, I can only own cats because I can't afford to own a dog. And I like the pictures in here, and it's just a very quick, entertaining, and a really fun read. So yeah, I recommend this for people who love dogs and for people who just like something very fast to read. And the next two books on my list are comic books or graphic novels, and the next one is... Archie Giant Comics Medley, and this is it right here. As I mentioned before, a, I'm a very huge Archie fan, and I really love reading the comic books. I've followed it since I was a kid, and my favorite character is Veronica, and I never fail to read a comic book digest from them. The last comic book on my list is the Archie Volume 3. It's the reboot series, and this time, um, this is Cheryl Blossom. For fans of Archie comics, you'll know who she is. She's the vixen character of the gang, and she's always after Archie, and she's always in competition with Betty and Veronica for boys. She belongs in a rich, wealthy family, and she's very pretty, she's very popular, and she's always out to get Archie, and... I really like the pencils and the artwork in this. It's very different from the old school classic Archie comics. Here they're a lot more um, realistic and a lot more like real teenagers instead of cartoony from the previous ones. So yeah. Let me know if you like Archie as well and if you guys like the new reboot series. And speaking of Archie, has anyone um, seen the new Riverdale TV series that's just come out? I'm still on the fence about that. I have only seen the first episode very briefly. It's got that New Zealand actor KJ Apa starring as Archie Andrews. And I feel like the TV series or the TV show is much darker and much more drama-centered. It feels like um, Pretty Little Liars or Dawson's Creek and all that and um, it's got a lot more teen issues and more serious issues and I'm still not sure if I like it or not. I think I need to watch more episodes to make a, an accurate judgment of it. But let, let me know if you've seen it and if you like it or not. So that wraps up my May book haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. 
Stay tuned for more videos and thank you guys so much for watching. I hope to see you next time. Bye!